This is the morning market in Sipo, northern Myanmar. I'm Adam. I'm a seed detective. I'm on the case to discover what it is about what we grow and what we eat that unites us all in our human diversity. As a seed detective, it's my job to get to the truth about what it is that brings together the farmer, the geneticist, the historian, the plant breeder and the chef in an amazing adventure around the world. So this is hybrid maize. Yeah, they're yeah. making more money by yeah, growing this. Money. But you lose all of that genetic information. And if you lose that, it's gone forever. My mission now is to try and get as many people as I can preserving our genetic biodiversity. This is a cucumber plant from Syria. Sadly now a bomb site. Fortunately, I've been able to grow it and save the seed. The best winter lettuce I've ever grown. Sometimes things just don't work. That is really, for me, a really exciting find this morning. Fantastic. That's a wow factor, isn't it? Who would ever think that somebody could look at a seed and say it's beautiful? But they are. I think they're gorgeous. Fava beans, the oldest cultivated crop in the world. My guide in Myanmar gave me these beans, which his mother grows in their garden. And he said to me, it's called the angry bean. This bean, I believe, has an extraordinary story behind it, that it hails from South America. I want to find out what's happened to it. How did it get to Myanmar, of all places? What I really love is trying to unravel so many stories behind how vegetables got their names, how they got to grow where they do, and invariably those stories include theft, burglary, avarice, greed, and just downright lying. 100, 200, peseto. The angry bean. The angry bean, yeah. it's true. Yeah. Will you cook that for me today, please? Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. Look at that. Wow. Angry bean. No, amazing. This angry bean, ironically, has made me very happy. 